Yeah, the band started in February 92. Trey and I formed it. I was playing with this one band and it sucked. So it was a going nowhere situation. It was like, well, I don't want to play until the songs are comfortable. And with Lolly Edge, it was, we slammed it together in a month and we were out there. And that's the way I wanted to do it. And it was, I was very fortunate to finally find that. About two years ago in February, uh, me and Greg just sort of had this uh, same vision of what the band should be like, and that's how we came about with this project. And uh, hopefully it's going to be what we do for our careers, you know, the rest of our life, make people money, and be a rock star. About a month after we started practicing, um, we started having problems with our drummer and singer coming to practice and just basically getting anything done. So we decided to put ads up in local music stores for, uh, for a new drummer. And then about three months later, Eric called uh, for the singer. Um, Dennis had wanted to be in the band for a long time. And so we finally decided to give him a, give him a shot. And he seemed to work out, so we kept him. The first two in the band, uh, they told me we had a month to play our first gig. And we practiced a lot, and about three times a week. But when we got together, it was for hours. And we got about 12 originals down and played our first gig, and it went pretty good. And Live shows have been great. Uh, we played Fresh Blood down at Venus, which is uh, in order to you know, get, get on, the, on the building down there, you, you play uh, Fresh Blood, which is just a uh, three or four bands. And uh, we sent Fletcher a, just a demo we made in my room. And uh, we played down there and got a really good response, crowd response from that. Um, from there, we went on to uh, open a couple shows for various bands. And then it wasn't a couple months before we were headlining down there. And the turnout's great, still is great. Uh, from our first gig, uh, we just got a really good response from all the people. and they. Uh, each show we played, they, they kept coming, and our shows got bigger, and I think the people caught on real quick. We were uh, playing a little heavier music than, than a lot of the other bands around, and, and a different style, and, and they really liked it a lot, and I could see it when we were playing, and, and from talking to, to our fans, and I don't know, just everything kind of clicked. When we started, we just wanted to play the music that we like to hear. Um, we were pretty much different than anything in the Little Rock scene at the time. And we came in on a whole new wave of, uh, of Little Rock bands uh, playing original music. And we're pretty much one of the only bands that's left from that initial scene. I'd say that we're maturing musically and we have a focus, we have a direction. We're writing songs with structure and we're shortening them up. Try and get down to a, you know, kind of a pop formula for writing songs, listenable stuff, stuff that people won't be tired of. Going, man, this song is so long. We first went to the studio in September of 92, uh, before our first show. And about, about every three months, we went back in and recorded at least two or three new songs. Um, we made four demos before we decided to, to pull our money together and uh, actually make one. Gas Heater is like a, a really strong first EP that, you know, that we've done in the past two years. It's, compared to the last recordings that we've made, it's a lot stronger. It's a, somewhat more complex than a, I think it's a lot more aggressive. Yeah, we've got, had really good response from the live show. I remember, uh, I think it was after our second headliner show down at Vino's, a guy named Debbie Lip came up and asked us if we'd be interested in doing a video. And uh, he does the uh, Video Zoo, which is a uh, local video program here that comes on. Uh, we went and did the video, and we were a local band of the month that month, and he was showing, showing the video two or three times a week. Uh, a lot of people got to see it. Um, had a lot of comments about that. Uh, 
pretty interesting making the videos, a little bit different than I thought it would be. But uh, yeah, it, it, it turned, turned us on to some new people as far as coming out to the shows because of the TV show. And it um, really worked out well. We've been getting a lot of uh, exposure lately. We released the tape and we were mentioned in Billboard magazine. They had a big write up on the Little Rock scene. And things are looking up for us, and we're hoping that everything's going to pull together. I think we're heading in the right direction. Uh, we play a lot, a lot locally, uh, played a few out of town shows. Um, everybody seems to be pretty happy with the direction that we're moving in. We've been together about two years now, and uh, we're continually writing new material. Uh, we released a tape last month. Um, got a lot of old demo stuff, been, been recording some, and uh, we still have live shows lined up and I think we're going in the right direction. Well, I mean, we progressed a lot here recently and, uh, and we'll just progress even more. We're starting to get more open and uh, we love playing music and we're going to play just about anything we can think of, you know, whether it be soft or light or anything like that. As far as the direction we're going now, I mean, we like it. We're a lot more diverse, and uh, we are becoming more of a band, I think. Heavy's cool, but I don't want to be heavy all the time, you know? I want to write. I want to expand us to everybody. I'd like to have something on a CD or whatever that everybody can go, I like that song. You know, a song for everybody. That would be cool. I think we've improved a lot in the two years we've been together. And I think you can hear that just by listening to the first demos and to the new tape. I think we've come into our own musically. Uh, at first, maybe we tried to emulate our influences a little too much. Uh, but I think we've, we've changed for the better. We're going to do everything we can to keep it that way. <laughs>